Brothers and sisters, like Israel is clay, so are we as believers in the potter's hand to be recreated in Christ Jesus. See, your first creation, your natural first creation was your mama brought you in this world. But the second spiritual recreation is a creation in Christ Jesus. I often, in my own personal devotions, refer to myself as a weak vessel of clay. That's how I see myself. I don't see myself as some great pastor, some great preacher. I see myself as a weak vessel of clay that God has chose to use. And everything in creation exists for the glory and honor and praise of God. This watch that I have on, and I don't want nobody to think it's super expensive because I don't want to have no problems later. Uh, not a Rolex, but it is a, a pretty good costly watch. But the reason it is a treasure is not because so much of what it costs, it's because it was given to me by my wife as a present. So it's a treasure to me. I bought this case. This is a watch case. So to protect the watch, after I wear it, I put it in this case because now I can drop it at least a little bit the case protects what's inside the case. It, it was made, the case was made to protect valuable watches. So I put my valuable watches inside the case. Now, what God has done that makes absolutely no sense whatsoever is God has reversed it. God has taken the treasure, the knowledge of him, the Holy Spirit, and placed it in you and me, weak vessels of clay. But if he can create the universe, then he can keep his weak vessels of clay together. I, I, don't, I don't understand it. I don't get it, but that's the way it works. During these last 15 months of dealing with the COVID-19 disease, dealing with social injustice, protests, rioting, dealing with economic devastation, dealing with broken families, dealing with lonely kids and adults, dealing with violence in our communities, dealing with sickness, death, fear, mental illness, stress, zoomed out. I'm here to tell you today that the treasure had to protect the clay. Because the clay, without the treasure in it, the clay without God living on the inside would have been broke and gone and out of here a long time ago. So give God some praise for the treasure that he puts in you and you and me, his clay.